session of the Legend Gamers present on the Legend Gamers Network Friday night in the building. About to get it in on this March 6th, 2023, the year of our Lord. And uh, we're about to go tearing, tearing ass through somebody's continent, taking over and establishing the law on uh, some expeditions Rome. Let's do it. Discovered some treasure. Uh, I see three caches. As you are making camp for the day, your people find a small plume of sand along the horizon. A singer, single rider galloping across the desert, unmistakably headed towards your group. Your Praetorians mount and ride and accept. It's a little escort of tired but grateful messenger. And we can spend money on stuff. We have no money. Assign a Praetorian to run interference, delay the attack. Oh, it looks like uh, one of my locations is about to get attacked. Apollo Apollonia is about to get attacked. Uh, we'll assign a pra Praetorian to slow him down. I'll send this princeps. He's loyal. He's a loyal man. Alright, let's go get lined up for Antisap. Here we go. We're gonna garrison a legion there. I need to go there too, apparently. Yeah, let me, I guess I'll go with him. Now I go with him and do this quest piece. It's been a fairly uneventful day until the path you were following is followed up by a dense by dense wilderness ahead. You consult your Kitorians and together you decide to press on as doubling back may cost you a day or more of travel. Of course in this place, wilderness is never just wilderness. Soon enough there is a sharp snap and a miserable howl of pain. As Fabius has stepped into some old hunting snare. 
His friends free him quite easily from the trap. The injury doesn't look too bad, but it's clear that his leg will need more than just a bandage. Truly, you may never catch a break. So, I was already headed to camp anyhow. Looks like we can get an upgrade to the bow. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a... Oh, that's not the same thing. Recrafting that seems to be of no benefit because I need to, I need to two the second version of that. That thing is trash. This bow right here is better than that. The Berber bow is better than that. Pristine basic armor. anything else well this is not a these toes right here aren't bad um they aren't bad they aren't bad uh templates but i need to get to this, the place where i can unlock the adjustments of this stuff because these this with a few more stats and one more random effects would be what we need oh and i guess that those epic lay those epic uh perks the epic weapon per perks yeah, yeah those only come from these though hmm. I'm, getting, I'm getting hyped just thinking about all the gear and stuff that you could potentially get and uh, how you can upgrade it and modify it i i hadn't even i'm not even up to a point where i can upgrade properly oh or am i can i can upgrade yeah, I can't upgrade or modif modify yet. Hold on, no, I, c I can modify. Right, I, think. I think I can modify. Oh, snap, I know you could. What? Wait a minute, I can do that now? Select charm. I got charms now. So yeah, it looks like no applicable charms. What? But I can't add a charm. What? Now, let me see if I can identify these charms in my regular inventory, because now I'm intrigued. I know some things have charm slots and it's not easily identifiable. Oh. I have some books I haven't read. schematics all over here
we do have an additional talisman, I see. Still not seeing what makes it makes me able to or gives me the option to uh, modify that that weapon with a charm. The first, so is that what those are? That's the charm slot. The first killing shot with it with an interrupted attack will not end the stance of life. Okay, sure. Let's I wonder how many more of these I've been slipping on. So when I sat, sat uh, I, was that how I upgrade that then maybe? Uh, I can't do that anymore because I don't have any ancient bows, but maybe if I break down the other one, I can get that back. Cause I think that's how I got that one. I just broke it down. Like I believe these parts can always be repurposed into something else, maybe. Anyway, let's get back into that modify. So it looks like a, I have I have a bow part, but I don't see where I have the parts for any of or maybe the schematics to do it as well. That's interesting. Oh, oh, it's, it's another bow. Yeah, I have a I have a, a bow charm, but no other ones so far. I think I might have to. This is a cool piece of armor. Queen's Warden 2, unique heavy armor. Who can wear this? I wonder if I can get that to old girl. She, if she's already wearing it. She should be wearing that armor, it looks cool. Somebody already wearing it. Let me go back and take a look at that. There's a 
modify section. Equipped by Baculus. Baculus. I like the way the armor looks, but I don't like the. I don't like this perk. But I like the way the armor looks, unfortunately. Okay, I guess I'll, I ain't gonna worry about that right now. But, uh, so yeah. Oh, that's a. I don't, I don't. Wow, that thing is pretty nice. Who the hell's wearing this? How's Ben? Me? My, my main. Okay. Pace damage increase. Base damage increased to one, accuracy to three. That's good too. Yeah. Now this is this is good where it's at. Wait that long. All right, let me get out of here. Make sure we got. Oh yeah, we need some of this stuff. We had some crazy fighting going on last game. Oh. I just realized I don't really have the money to really. Oh, well, I could use some free ones. Oh, replenish the water, cause of course. Possibly a pillum two out there somewhere. Let's get a recruiter on the job. Oh, our recruiter is injured. We got another one. Oh no, that's not how I was looking for. I'm looking for this guy. I can't afford any new people anyway. I'm gonna leave that alone. Up like I can. Oh, I guess I can't activate any of these early ones. Hold on. It's got a notification as if I could unlock something. That's a little notifications harassing me. All right, now we really we just wait. Can't go in the outpost outpost. Oh, this one's kind of tough. I got a sizable army too. Hundred percent survive chance for all my members here. I like that. I want to get these logistics up. That logistics specialization. So let him lead this. 
Oh no. Dude, here's got the best strat. I'm gonna go with the logistics here because I do want him to get that extra bonus level of it. Start working on that. So we're gonna grind it out. We'll, we'll hold, hold fast. How do you wish to deploy? That's, that's the most strategic thing I'm gonna do here. I'm just gonna click buttons. By design. This fight, I'm actually putting my people through some adversity. I can skip some of that. I'll skip some of that. The men are close enough to engage. Getting bonuses for positive work. for the games L's for the games we're trying to get this dude level L's for the games was really in the end it's all in the end that's a sometimes part of the grind I, so, I, so I've been told the enemy is deploying their tactical reserves on this one. Oh no, they, their aggression is pretty heavy. Yeah, ultimately, no, no big deal. Let me see. Right, we'll lose a little morale. We'll get some good gain towards uh, towards logistics level leveling. How's your weather out there, the Black Indy Dev? We are victorious! Commander Dev. <laughs> I have I have no idea of the hierarchy. It's hot, man. That's good. That's good, man. Glad to hear that. Springtime. Springtime's right around the corner. I'm looking forward to springtime. We got we actually got out in the yard today. I'm sorry, not today, yesterday. Got out in the yard and raked some leaves. So Wellington, what's the damn deal on the bees and the grizzle? Welcome back to the channel. I'm just, um, I'm selecting. I'm, this is my equivalent of uh, jumping on a fighting game and pressing buttons. Right now. Zenite militez exultare. He said something. He said something in in um, Roman, and we defeated the enemy. And it looks like he got the final level of that logistics bump, so we won't take another another grindy loss on the next one. I'm sorry, another grindy win is what I mean to say. Because uh, we, we did not lose, we won, but it was sloppy. It, it, it was it was a try hard win. We had command, uh, uh, le left, left lo uh, lieutenant try hard, lieutenant, left lieutenant try hard, <laughs> right? Model diversity in this game. What did the? This is these are the real days. All right. 
Let's see what they got at the trader's hut. We need money. Came to the barracks and cooked for us the other got a whole bunch of slaves. Oh, wait, look up. Oh, they resupplied the money bin, and money is down, and slaves is up. Yes. <laughs> Somebody came in here and dumped some change for something. I don't know. They, they must have bought all the medicine. <laughs> Somebody came in and bought all the medicine. All right. Well, let's get, let's get on up off some of these. Some of these Salway. For the Nari. Yeah, yeah. Cause I ain't really got, I don't have a major campaign going on right now. So I might as well just liquidate my slave, um, account. Do you have bank a moment to speak to an old soldier? I've traveled far to meet you. Oh, this dude came to, came to holler at the damn precept. Came to talk to me. Let's see what we can do. Good night, Lagate. I hope you will not fault me for asking to speak to you at such a late hour. My name is Sabinus Orsinus. I was the proconsul's praefectus until last year. How did you reach us? I had retired before the death of Lucullus. When I heard what had happened, I knew I had to find you. I have many friends among the Berbers. A few of them agreed to help me make the journey. Uh, are you a friend of Ingotius Nassau? We are acquainted from back in the day. We spoke regularly when we were managing the daily affairs and logistics of our respective legions. But he owes me nothing, nor do I owe him. You were the Prefectus Castrorum of Legio Prima Italica. I don't remember you from Greece. I was there, but we had little reason to speak. You were given command of Wictrix before we even met. Why have you come here? I'll speak freely. You are a great commander and a loyal heir of Lucullus, but despite your victories, you are still inexperienced. You spend much time traveling with your own contubernium and getting into scraps, delegating tasks and decisions that are normally the meat and bones I ain't of trying your to tell position you my goddamn Lucatus. business. I admire that, as do the men. But if you'll forgive my presumptuousness, you must do more to inspire the troops and make them feel as brothers. Man, the number one option is where I really want to go. But playing in character, I am always open to suggestion and searching for ways to improve. Tell me what you have in mind. I am glad to hear it. That attitude is part of what Lucullus saw in you, I believe. In my opinion, you are in need of a banner. A standard that you can erect on the field of battle to rally your men. I can teach you how to create a banner that honors Mars. Such a symbol can turn the tide of any fight. Um, let me guess. You seek payment for that service. When I retired from the Legion, I was promised a generous pension. I never received a single denarius. I have a wife and children, Legati. They need to eat. What? Hold up. How does this wind up with an inspirational talk and now you you trying to shake me down for 1,000 denarii, bro? Hold up. How we get here? <laughs> Hold up, man. What? I don't care about no goddamn banner for no damn one thousand dollars, bro. Oh, oh, you offer me a oh, so okay, so he gonna allow me, he gonna allow me to unlock some customization options for a thousand bucks. All right, that's that's fine. I, I just came, I just sold off some slaves. This is the least I can do. You know, I, I sold them so they can live a better life. Um, really, I, I I sold them. I sold them. It was a nice work contract deal. They are gonna get out in about. Five, they're gonna have to put in about five good years and they're gonna get some land and shit. Don't, 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 don't look at them like this. Ain't the same, this ain't the same thing, boy. This ain't the same. So let me see. Um, oh, uh, yeah, let's that go. That is very generous of you, Legate. This will help my family a great deal. 
Thank you. I will draw up the instructions for how to build a standard, like the one that used to inspire us when I fought for Prima Italica. All you need is to get your smith to forge the idol for the top of it. Thank you, Orsinios. I wish you a safe trip home. And I wish you a good and victorious war. These lands are beautiful, but harsh, and they hide many secrets. Keep your wits about you, and perhaps we'll see each other again someday. So I can do stuff now? With my banner? night when we were drinking with the gladiator. Legati. The Legato Help Praetorian. Me. From Mauritania. Yeah, bestia you talent. A seemingly endless font of She's amazing gone. stories. Let me tell I don't understand you. The arena sometime. Why did she run away from me? She's blind. How could she have evaded the guards? That's impressive, no matter how you cut it. We could have used her. No one will use my sister again. It's That's a figure of speech, big guy. Relax. Why would she leave, though? She was finally free. You have always assumed she'd want to be free, Bestia. Perhaps that's not what she wants. For one who knows no freedom, there is no servitude. I see. I have, indeed, never considered this. No, nope, that makes no I easy. know what I will do. I shall find her and then kill her. Yes, sir. That's, That's that the only way. Might very well be the case. She ain't, she probably died a long time ago, actually. How these things go. You're right. You should put her out of her misery. Indeed. Misery. Her life was always full of it. She's unable to recognize joy. Happiness is the lack of misery. Joy is the lack of pain. I can't bring her joy or happiness, but at least I can end her pain and misery. That is not what I meant, Bestia. At least I don't think so. It is the understanding you have led me to. Okay. So they, they did a second check on whether or not I really want to do, do this. Now I'm having second thoughts. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm quite with the idea of putting her out of her misery, but she might, I mean, she what she's, she thinks she got her, did she get her tongue cut out? I know her eyes are gouged out. Her, I think it's just her eyes. She's like, uh, actually, no, nah, she's like Julia. She's like Julia. Now that I think about it, she's a little bit like Julia from Fist of the North Star. I think Julia was blind, right? No, no, not Julia. I'm thinking about the little girl. Oh, uh, I forgot her name. The little, the little girl from the movie. She, um, she couldn't talk. That's right. And then Cam healed her, and then she was able to talk. So. Don't. It was talking now this chick here got her eyes gouged out she got her eyes gouged out and many unspeakable things happened to her um you know i think i mean it's just her eyes right and they were gouged out she can she didn't have to see some of that stuff that happened right does that make it worse i don't know Well, let's see what happens. Don't do it. Don't do it. I'm, I'm second, don't. 
As long as she lives, there's always hope that she might find her way out of the suffering and learn to live a better life. But if I let her live, she'll be lost forever. She will eventually succumb to her suffering and die. At least she will die on her own terms. Don't deny her that freedom. Very well. She's free to suffer then. She and I both. Interesting. And looks like we got some XP off that. Or was that XP for the turn? Oh. Okay. We got one Sinisi Sinikio level. That's one of my new people because I don't recognize that name at all. All right. Oh, what's Cineros talking about? Looks like we got folks. Oh, no, that's probably just the regular dialogue, but I hadn't talked to them in a while. Let's see if we got any new dialogue with the main team. Domine. Now that Cleopatra is helping us, I think we have an advantage. I don't think so. Not yet. Do you think she will betray us? At this level of politics, loyalty is something no one can afford to possess or count on. To be honest, we're in a mess here. Loyalties will shift constantly and without mercy. A failure of anticipation is very likely to prove fatal. We must constantly pay attention to every single word and gesture. Do you think we arrived too late? You will probably not like my honest opinion. Uh, tell me anyway. I think our arrival wasn't anticipated by our adversaries, and therefore it can be said we arrived too early for them. I believe the events leading to the proconsul's death could not be prevented. But it seems to me it was our arrival that triggered the murder itself. I wonder why all of these elders are in our favor. As always, it is a matter of priorities. They favor us as long as our actions align with their goals. That will not always be the case. The most intelligent of enemies will try to befriend you. It is the honest ones who openly oppose their foes. An honest enemy is virtuous, and therefore, fallible. What would you Greeks know of virtue? I can't answer that question. Virtue is not for oneself to judge. However, those who follow a strict set of rules are naturally restricted in options which, in return, makes them fallible. Hey, Fluffy Fox. Welcome back, welcome back. Long time no see. Things have been well, I hope. Welcome back to the channel. Oh yeah, we're still we're still in here doing it uh, on some uh, total, what does total, I was gonna say total war expeditions. <laughs> some expeditions roam, expeditions roam. Yeah. Uh, you've been busy? That's good. Busy is good. Busy is good. Here's the constructive busyness. You seem relaxed in Africa. The dry air agrees with my old bones. And I always wanted to visit Africa, especially Egypt. I just wish the circumstances were less dreadful. Uh, we need to keep our spirits up. That we do. An army low on morale loses the war before battle is even joined. We need to keep our spirits up. In other words, we need wine. Wine in wine, indeed. Everyone's been calling me Legotus for some time now. You could do the same if you wanted to. Thank you for your offer, but I must respectfully decline. I am not just anyone. I have served your family since before you were born. The fact that your military rank has changed doesn't mean you're not my Dominus still. 
I am proud of the man you have become, and it is with pride that I shall continue to serve you. Let us talk later. Uh, how am I? I'm well. I'm well. I'm maintaining and, you know, avoiding, avoiding getting a cold. I think that's my biggest enemy at the moment, among other things, among, among the overall arch nemesis of, of the peoples. Uh, my person, one of my more ready assailants from lurking is um, a bug going around the house, but otherwise I'm pretty good. Talked to Cineros already. He had some new dialogue. Let's see who else has new dialogue. Yeah. Uh, currently running turn based tactical strategies for the week, for the play week. Weekends are always a mixed bag, as you see on the schedule, if you didn't know. What do you uh, make of this burble? Oh, hey, Legate. They fought well when Would you and your Praetorian guards spar with my contraband? Oh, no. I'll be glad to have them. I for one don't like it. The Legion is for Romans. What the Nazimonians care about serving Rome? Come, let us talk. No, we have the rightful ruler of Egypt on our side. When every man fights for himself, you must make alliances. That is how the arena works. Yet sometimes when you are allied, you forget only one man can win. Do you think she will betray us? Without batting an eye, if she has to. An ally can always turn into a foe. Better to kill your allies before they get the chance. <laughs> we seem to be getting ourselves into more trouble. We have abducted the Queen of Egypt, who is also a goddess. She was imprisoned by her husband, the Pharaoh, who is incidentally also a god. I believe when people say that you are famous for punching above your weight, this is what they mean. Hmm. Some of the people here seem sympathetic to our cause, at the least. As long as the Berbers are fighting each other, it will be easier for us to win. But do not forget, sympathy is temporary. Fear is eternal. You are right, but fear is an unreliable tool. Commanding fear is an art. One must train. One must always train. Ole. So you've just been depressed recently? Well, here's to that turning around for you sooner than later, you know? Pull yourself out of that, that hole, take a shower. Showers are good. Uh, my my lay uh, recommendation. That's a recommendation. Let's see, Julius Cleopatra. How are you holding up? Do you trust Cleopatra? Of course not. And you'd be a fool if your intention is to place your trust in her. That woman is a predator. She's a man. Without a doubt, she's no. using you. Do not fall for her tricks. But we need her. Do we though? Or is that what she wants you to think? Do you think the Court of Heaven can serve as an outpost? It's lucky we arrived during this festival or whatever it is. We have all of the important people in one place. But keep in mind, this is their land. The Court of Heaven is an uncontrolled hub of activity. There's no telling who comes and goes and what their intentions are. Well, eh? Two or five sectors pacified. Hey, my man, Queso. You know, I have nothing but love and respect for our Yulia Kalida. But do you wonder where she's been over the past few years? She seemed to vanish into the world as soon as we returned to Rome. She reappeared only once Lucullus had need of her. She said she didn't like being in Rome. And why is that, I wonder? The Yulii can trace their lineage back to the founders of Rome, they say. 
If anyone should feel at home there, it's her. I trust her, as far as it is reasonable to trust such a talented spy. But there's something she isn't telling us. How can I help you? Now we have a goddess on our side. Indeed we do. She's an impressive woman. Beautiful and with a natural authority. And I hear she's single. <laughs> I would not dishonor a woman of her caliber by pursuing her affections. Besides, I'm not sure I would survive the endeavor. It seems like we have made some unexpected allies here. I have to say I'm impressed by their court of heaven. The meeting they held looked like a primitive image of our Senate. Yet this new agreement we have reached worries me. If you fight the wars of others, be certain that you stand to benefit in proportion to your sacrifices. We're in a bit of a mess, aren't we? <laughs> aren't we always? Nobody needs soldiers when everything's fine. It's just that I prefer knowing exactly who we're fighting against right now. Don't worry. We will do just what we always do, and the enemy will reveal itself. Certainly. We will be ready when the time is right. Carry on. Sextus, you've had a rough two weeks. Oh, so wait a legionary. Does it? Do you see in sight? Today. I'm gonna leave him to his work. Apparently, was this? Hey, is this my girl? I'm dealing in Aura. Oh, hey, legate. What do you need? Well, we've got some of the Berbers on our side, at least. In tribal society like this, that is best you can hope for. I don't know about Lunia, though. Keep eye on her. She has look in her eye, like she knows something we do not. Well, uh, Cleopatra seems willing to back us. I like her. She is charming and sophisticated, but suddenly she is very brash and mean. Carry on. Cleopatra, let's see. So Sixtus is doing his thing. I piloted all my people. Bastia, Luya, Kalida. All right, I think. Uh, let's go and call her a Tullius Ostis, Oristus. Please excuse me. Tullius Oristus. Please excuse me. Now There's got to be some kind of way out of here. Of this land, things are bound to get a bit complicated. This isn't Asia Minor, after all. Hmm. Africa was under Roman control before, but the natives will not appreciate the more firm hand that wartime requires. I'm afraid you may once more need to take care of certain situations personally. Uh, what kind of situation are you talking about? There are so many tribes in this region of Africa, I don't even think we have enough numbers to count them. The Legion is strong, but it's a bit like Sextus Hammer. Sometimes you need smaller force to take care of delicate situations. This sounds like the responsibility of a centurio. Centurio. It is good practice to delegate tasks indeed. However, I believe pacifying certain factions would require a speculator's touch. I understand. Let me know if such a situation arises. Remember, Legate, until we take care of any such disturbances, we won't be able to control any territory we have captured. Our way, Legate.
What's up with the We're nearly with a little I should we have many legionari still missing in action. All right, yeah. I need to do that while I'm thinking about it. Let's go to the barracks. I got a slot for one more person. I need to hire one more person. No, no, no. Think about it. Uh, there should be some new people here, right? I want the new people. Here we go. The non-stars. Oh, he's disgruntled. Look at him. Oh, this dude's got the what? He's got a little. Bit, he's got a little bit of everything. Nothing good for wartime though. But he's definitely good for staying his ass at the base. I might keep him solely for base duty. He's got good base stuff. He's got these sh shitty ass wartime skills. If, I think if the game goes on that long, I actually need to level that. I maybe would use him for that. <clears throat> Who is this guy? Uh, another tri Triarius is like low key one of my favorite new classes. A physician can treat burn, infection, and poison injuries. Okay, see now. Not all Triarius are physicians. Huh. I might need to look into that. If not all Triarius are physicians, then I need to make sure I'm hiring physician. Oh, look at this, a doctor can treat Lazarus. Oh. I wonder if that's just on the road stuff that they talked about right there. So not all triarius are physicians let me take a look at something oh you know what i think i'm gonna hire that guy because that looks useful He's a rank four. Triarius, I'm gonna hire him. He's got some buff stuff. He's got some med medic stuff. I think I'm gonna max out the current stuff that he, that he has. On the, all the way when I say max out I mean max out at the current level he has access to and then I'm gonna move him over to destroyer I don't have a destroyer so I'm gonna move him over to destroyer um, but uh, I am interested in him being able to when selected to command the Legion in battle and experience medicals increases the casualty survival rate and more of your legendary ability be injured instead of killed. Okay. He ain't, he ain't much for wartime, but he does have. Uh, so he can. He got a little bit of everything, but I'm more interested in this treating burns, infections, and injuries, or poison injuries. That part is what makes me curious. I'm gonna hire this dude. I'm gonna hire him. I can only hire one of them. I'm gonna hire him because he's um he's been wanting to be hired for a while anyway, so he's been around. I wasn't impressed with the new stuff, which looked like it might have been this fella here. Looks like the only newer face I can think of. Uh, these other folks, have we I believe we've worked together before. Yeah, we hired him. Right, but um, what's going on with this party? Oh, let's replenish some people. So you just been trying not to cry for the these rough two weeks? Oh man. Yeah. Well, you, if it, if it's, I mean, have you been crying that long? Have you have you cried? If, you know. So we're all full up right there. What is the deal with this party thing? These notifications killing me. Oh, there it is. 
I guess, oh, maybe it was telling me that the dude had finished. No, oh, they probably they finished their duties. That's what they returned back to the regular party pool. That's what that is. That's what that is. Now, of course, I'm not able to identify what the hell this one is <laughs> for some reason. I know that that exclamation point up there is driving me crazy right now. You know that, right? You may or may not know that. Oh, here we go. Stone walls increases the legion strength when the outpost is attacked by 15%. I don't care nothing about that. I promise. And then furthermore, I, want, <clears throat> I know they're going to just let me jump over there to that one. That's why I even counting that. That's ridiculous. Why is that even the thing? And then they don't show it here at all. They lame down. Oh, oh, I see what's happening. They want me to do this and then I can. I'm not wasting my materials on. Oh, hold on. Leave right on. I, don't want to battle. I don't care about stratagems. I want as soon as they give me access to another goddamn harvesting point right here, this farm. I'm getting a damn forge because I'm missing out on all kind of customizations because I don't have a damn forge. And that makes me upset. It's just been like twice. You, you can, Oh, twice. Okay. Twice. Um, how, uh, how many times in between? Like, did you cry like in December and then you came back in, in uh, February and you cried in February? on the on the on the 14th or was it like you cried at 8 a.m today and then you cried at 10 30 a.m and you were cool because you ate a ham sandwich that a whole a hobo pulled out of their inner coat pocket they pulled that that held that ham sandwich out and offered it to you and you were fine for the, a few few hours. Then I don't yeah, how I don't how spaced out was it? I'm asking for a reason. Okay, Sunday and Tuesday. Okay, well. Okay, Sunday and Tuesday of last week. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess that was last week. All right. Well, apparently what it is, you ain't crying enough, so you might need to go go do some more crying. Is all I'm saying. The the situation that was it the same situation now. If each of those were different situations, that is interesting. I mean, that is also interesting. How about that? actually afford to do this now before I leave rather than waiting Hold on. I'm, I'm not exactly sure how to do this that is not what I was looking to do there we go Oh, he ain't done yet. How long? 23 hours? All right, we're going to wait 23 hours to get these free, free replenishments. I'm saving my money, goddamn. Now, I wish it would be great if you could, there was a way you could get to the world map without having to leave the damn main camp. That seems like a needless thing to do, but they did that also in um, Pathfinder. I gotta beat one of these main week games because uh, I would like to get into some Pathfinder this year. If uh, we still don't have any, haven't gotten into, or I believe Pathfinder is gonna be my off game where once, uh, once, if, if um, we haven't gotten onto it by the time Baldur's Gate 3 drops. By the time, by, yeah, by the time Baldur's Gate 3 drops, if we haven't gotten to Pathfinder, 
you, you know, that's uh, it's highly possible I'll be running both of those titles at some point this year, depending on where things go or where things are. Anyway, that was a bit of a divergence. What is this? Why is there a red thing here? Because there's a Roman. Oh, they must got to leave. Yeah. You kick their ass, they got to go. Oh, I'm waiting on something. Oh, the replenishment. That's right. All right, so now I should be able to, oh no, oh, it's almost done. Okay, yeah, here we go, we got them freebies. back out in the field but first let's level up some of these folks I doubt I have any oh, oh wait a minute wait a minute we got something that looks good it's hard to give up the that every time you kill a character you restore maximum health joint that's hard to get rid of right there um, I'm tempted to either break that down. I would love to get that emblem off of that thing. I wonder if I could do that. Like, he he needs a different weapon for real. Like he needs something that's gonna. Cause I really don't have him attacking right now. And at this point, where he's at, and considering his favorite armor is his damn toga, I wouldn't put him in a combat situation. I I want him to all his weapon gear. I would want to be geared towards healing and buffing at this point. Um, yeah. Somebody went missing and you knew them well. He also works for a radio station. Then. This is the podcast every week in the morning. Oh, damn. They went missing? Like, it's been reported that they went missing, or did they, uh, just they hadn't been back on the podcast in a while. Oh, I see. Well, you know, here's to oh, okay. Well, here's to him. Um, if he's missing, that means he's not dead, right? And hopefully, he'll return to his family and his, his uh, following soon enough um just know that if i if i suddenly go missing it's highly possible that white supremacy get, finally got me and by that i mean mcdonald's gave me a heart attack so no no that's where it is and and i forgive no one just know that I did not forgive anybody. So let's see. You can't tell if that was a joke or not. That, that, that last part, no, that was actually not a joke. That my delivery was in was purposeful, but it was not a joke. Because ultimately, that's that's what led me here, and and that's where we are. And that's where we are today. Day. I forgive no one. I forgive myself. You are next. <laughs> I forgive no one. So let's see. And uh, and there you go. And and speaking of speaking of being depressed. So let's see. Oh my goodness. See this this right here is the staff I think it would do him better than the one that he currently has. It would make more sense. It's not really a pokey killer staff or anything. Uh, you know, although like one of the benefits of this rod of acephalus the first or whatever is that 
that thing every time you kill somebody you restore like anytime he does fight it's good that that's that is a thing but um and oh yeah and see that's another thing too it increases the healing done by a percentage that's why i've been holding on to this but my thing is i would like to if i could break this down and re re um reforge it better like i would like to do that but i don't i that's one of the you know what let me save let me save and see what if i get like part the main part of it back and i can put it on another piece of equipment that would be of interest you playing a game what game are you playing floppy roblox ah roblox seems like the perfect game to um just kind of get it all out in <laughs> seems like they got a they got like a mod for everybody out there roblox is good stuff so what was it oh that's right i wanted to break down that weapon i don't need an armor to do that yeah, let's break down this weapon and see if it gives us anything cool. Oh, we learned Rod of Acephalus 1. Ooh, extracted a lot of cool stuff. Let me see if I can, what happens if I make a new one, because the one that I currently have is garbage. Okay. I th think that's good. No, I think the new rods, the new rods are... 9 to 12 see so yeah that's what i mean like the, the, i need some the rod of acephalus needs a part two because it's starting to get outranked by some of this stuff 7 to 10 no actually okay 7 to 10 every now and then okay i could deal with that looks like there's a decent average for rods out here let me see i got my tr i got my damage dealing try it so yeah i got him on some crazy shit. look at that 9 to 12. that makes sense so then i'm glad i did that that was cool. But JV's wife posted that JV is not coming back. Okay. Oh, he's not coming back. Like, is he dead? That's one. That's what. That's what's got me. Like, he's done. I gotta admit, I'm only gonna. I'm only gonna give so much to that if the man is still alive and just gone. Cause I, I just don't know him like that. But I, I know that it matters to you, and I just hope. I hope that at least they're not dead. For the you know, well, for the most part, for the most they're not dead. It's important. I'm just peeking in right now. All is well. Hey, all is well. All is well. Good. Fluffy got somebody's missing, and we we'll, we'll give them, send them all. You know, the best wishes. Best wishes that everything works like it should. Two ten LG in a goddamn building. Yo, man. So did two ten LG. Uh, your your computer, everything come back together pretty decently on the computer. You got it got it back up and running it's, it's fine i i know you may have had a few other things you wanted to get going on it but uh he's also had suicidal experiences oh, okay so far you back on okay solid solid did you um i don't know if you uh you plan you know what you know, I don't know if you back streaming or whatever, but I know, um, you know what I'm saying? I know you do stream or you did, so I'm, gonna, I'm still going to give you that shout out. You know what I'm saying? Cause the people need to know what the hell I was really happening. Okay, I'm... You know what I'm saying? We still on that kind okay, of time. Right there. All right. <laughs> That's all, you know? That's all. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Somebody clip that, please. LG probably knows. I said somebody clip that, please. Let's go. That was good. I ain't gonna lie. That was that was hot. <laughs> that was hot. <laughs> I like that. The people should know. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. The people. The people should know. I've been on this screen for a while. It's because I'm trying to. There's a lot of shit going on in this game, bro. All right. <laughs> there's, a, there's a lot of shit. Yo, y'all guys could probably process this way quicker. But this is where I'm at. I, I don't even, even know if folks got on got on the damn you know, sneakers. All right. Oh, I was gonna go into the army now that I broke that down. 
and rebuild a new Rada Acephalus and build it better. Let's put it in the crafting hall. You know something? I realize now that I think about it. Let me take a look at something else. Let me cancel this. Let me see if I can go to modify and um, maybe modify a staff with the rod of Acephalus's thing. how you do it you break down those epic ones and you can put it on the other stuff that's actually cool yeah we figured it out we, we know what it's all about and we're gonna 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 explode it's the same thing when i play 2k how you living <laughs> how you living we gotta bust a bombay all right, all right, all right. I, I was i was i was right that's where i was at that it's the same thing. okay yeah, there's a lot going on. <laughs> there's a lot going on. Uh, you're gonna have to learn how to get the command going. That command going. Oh, oh man, shit, that ain't. Shit, uh, you, you got you, you got it. You got it. You streaming tonight, bro? What are you, what are you doing, man? Uh, I think yeah, I'm, I'm I'm excited about that. I'm excited about the fact that I, I got the I figured I, I under, They may have mentioned it, but I don't recall it wasn't like and they didn't emblazon it and take me through like a tutorial of it or nothing This game it has tutorials, but I, there's stuff. It does not. There's a lot of stuff. It doesn't tell you Like you can find out if you're just kind of paying a little bit more attention and so I might have missed when they when they said that hey in order to modify, in order to take the perks, the charms off of shit and put it on other shit, you need to break stuff down and you, you'll get the charm. I don't recall seeing that part, but I'm happy I've, I've deduced it. I'm happy about that. So we're gonna modify this on a better weapon with a base damage of 10 to 13 and adjustable stats this is really good um i kind of don't care nothing about critical chance because this is not my damage dealer guy hold up who's using this oh scenarios is using this okay that's exactly what i want to be happening so i might take critical chance off because i'm not really interested in that base damage extra bludgeoning extra bludgeoning what does bludgeoning damage do i'm doing bludgeoning damage i might why the hell not critical damage increase yeah i guess if he has to bludgeon bludgeon hard base damage minimum maximum base damage minimum increase i'll go with a base damage minimum increase i like that oh extra bludgeoning damage now let's go with x let's just this is just the beat stick it's the beat stick king t 96 yo man i was thinking about you just the other day I was thinking about you the other day, but I ain't blow you up on the phone. I was like, you know, I ain't gonna call for you. I ain't gonna call for you. I ain't gonna call nephew up. Gotta let him live his life. May none of the horrors I envision pass, or pass his path. <laughs> May he never be visited by the seven horrors. But uh, let's see, me too, for real. <laughs> Blessed to be in the game. Hey, thank you. Yeah, glad you, glad you uh, in here, bro. It's all my pleasure. The pleasure is mine. Um, well, you can bother me whenever. Hey, granted you're not busy. That's what's up. Hey, hey. Well, I hope that's. I hope you're busy. I hope you're busy with constructive things often. So then I will never talk to you. <laughs> I had my way. I would never talk to you because you'd be busy with constructive things often. But uh, <laughs> you've been door dashing or you've been doing a you've been doing a uh, <laughs> boy, 
I was just about to get boy you've been doing the tether express I'm just gonna leave it there nobody hurt me nobody hurt me nobody hurt me alright but that's what's up hey dash 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 for the cash get the grab get the bag see him in the lab right all right here's the uber driver nah uber is what to do hey if you get that hustle you get the hustle work for you make it damn happen and hey, i am i um i said what i said i don't believe it leave, leave it on that I can't, I'm gonna catch you. I'm gonna catch back up with you next week, and we for the check in, right? Hey, it's something on the side, boom. That's all. That's a. Hey, that's all. That's all. What, uh, what I'm talking about right there. On on the damn side, where all a all a all a mode. Or is that all a la carte? Uh, so I got the charm. I'm I'm. You, you guys don't don't get this, but I'm still excited about the fact that i found that this charm can transfer so I'm, I'm gonna hit that almighty button i finally got everything selected like i was looking for wow there it is there it is we got him with a superior weapon looking good smoking good drinking good he, uh, he does like the wine i'm just saying so we're gonna get that crafted man that changes the dynamic of everything now now that i can transfer the really now that i can transfer those char those charms i can legit sideways modify the weapons in a great way because see right now i can't i can't um i cannot oh i didn't have all of i didn't i did not complete that because i'm missing the dude but right now i cannot um I cannot upgrade weapons. I cannot upgrade weapons right now because I'm missing uh, a base a component at the, my uh, headquarters. So this is locked off to me. So that's a whole nother toy I can't play with right now, but modify, I can modify. And I messed that up last time. Oh no, no, I didn't, here it is. Oh, you don't even have to wait to modify. You can just do that right off the top. Oh, look how it turned golden. It turned golden. What? And I think that might be golden. Actually, as the equipment itself, when they're holding on to it, it might be gold. Let's take a look. That's not the guy. Don't get, don't get too happy. That's not the dude that's using it. Here it is. He's using it. It don't look gold to me. I don't I don't think it changed the, the uh, skin of it that significantly. But in the picture, it was golden when it wasn't initially so I yay to that I suppose let me get back in there I'm gonna take a look at that modify button again hold up I might be lying it might have been it might not have been it might have been the golden the whole time anyway so that's been modified I'm pretty happy about that um this odyssey oh never mind no this is um no this is something else <laughs> this is this is something else Say, I'm gonna show you what the NFA finna feel like. Oh no, might need. Oh, might need to try Uber, man. I hear, I hear some interesting things off Uber, but you kind of gotta set it up, um, set it up right though. Like, you gotta be targeting, like specifically targeting. So I don't hear, I don't hear some, not you know, like targeting a spot. It's crazy. I, 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 I can't speak on it, but I've heard some interesting strategic stuff from a good source on Uber. So, it may not be a bad idea. I mean, it's never a bad idea when you look at an improved situation. You know what I'm saying? Nah, but uh, this uh, so. Yeah, I don't care nothing about this. I never cared about these safety just like the, uh, uh king tk this skill on this piece of gear I, these this skill on this piece of gear shows up on a lot of different um games where you can where you have skills and perks and i hate them i hate those just like i hate the the ones where you got to kill the enemy to get the health back like you know you get you get you gain extra health upon uh, an enemy's death i hate those too Cause they were they required they were they guaranteed they, they got me gambling on some garbage because i won't talk about the one about the health but this one specifically that means you got to be in a death position and i'm just not really with that 
this this gear this this piece of gear right here it says the first attack in each encounter that will bring you to zero health will instead leave you to one health with with one health remaining it's strong because that's why i feel about it i don't want this i would as much as i can help it i will always swap out these skills for something that's way more useful and how i want play i ain't trying to play on no death this some old death dirge mess that's some old damn death dirge like i am only my best when i'm dying like what this ain't i don't even think a, a berserker wouldn't even want to use that a berserker I, I don't know i take it back a berserker might want just one more chance to die hard i don't know a high risk high reward man that ain't no risk that's just you can you can stand there with your defense wide open again get, get that perk to pop i don't nobody want that <laughs> ain't no fun in that man forget that this thing it was so i i so i'm like i like the way that this armor looks the queen ward in the second armor but i'm i'm not with that mod i hate the mod on it so I, it would be it would be cool if i get this queen's warden thing but somebody's wearing this i'll break that down at some point but now that i know that I, that's how i could do that like for instance this occam's razor is garbage so i can i can um get rid of this and craft a like a Puggio and add the Occam's razor add this thing to flanking enemies and that make much better man I'm gonna have to do that offline because that's so deep that I, I just I don't want to burn up too much of my stream time with you guys here we're messing with that so let me let me uh let me get my skills leveled because we have some people that leveled right you want to do that right so uh, let me uh this dude here is going down the sniper line. Plus two optimal range does not affect maximum range. Damn, that's dope. I want, I like my snipers to be uh, interrupt, interrupt artists also. Let's give, he's already interrupt. Let's go one point, one more point down here. All right, this is turn-based. Um, this year, I tried to do fighting games and I guess got scrubbed up too much and I don't have the patience no more. <laughs> this year was supposed to be fighting game year. That's why I lost all my followers because they were like, we're waiting for fighting game. You ain't do that. You did entirely the opposite. So instead I opted to do turn-based tactical strategy. So all the titles this year are some form of turn-based tactical strategy. And we may step it down to turn-based right because we got some turn-based hybrids but yes this is a turn-based tactical um strategy title when the combat ensues but there is actually a lot of rpg elements in it also and um some minor base building but uh yeah this is a this i was not expecting this game to be this good when i got it um it it was like a new release a few uh it was either like 2022 when it came out or or no it was 2022 when it came out it was a newer title so it had that new title price tag on it i think this thing retailed at like 49 dollars or something without a sale and i ain't never heard of it right but it came up because I, I occasionally will do a term you know turn-based uh title search here and there and it came up in my turn-based title search one time and i was like i ain't never heard of this and and i think it was on epic it might have released on epic first maybe and i saw it on epic and uh, i looked at it up like, it looks turn-based and i was like eh. first of all it costs a lot of money it's talking about a campaign i don't really care about and it costs it costs a lot of money and so i was like i don't know who developed it goddamn um black indie dev kept kept trying to blame sega <laughs> he blamed sega for like two days I'm, I'm sorry two weeks came through last week it was like hey sega made this right i was like no nah, still not sega <laughs> the first time i had to look it up i think it was what thq <laughs> this man's like did sega make this i was like no nah, they didn't make this it's not made by sega i know it looks like sega did because there's a certain curious veneer of quality to it but they did not make this um and uh 
I was not expecting it to be that good, but uh, I got it. I caught it on sale for a ridiculous price, and I am not regretting that whatsoever. I decided to make it a, a staple of my uh, turn based tactical strategy completion. Not only is this the turn based tactical strategy uh, year, I'm also attempting to complete some of these turn based tactical strategies that I've started. So, uh, yeah. um, uh, Persona Rogue Galaxy and Tales are all the only turn based, a good point, turn based games. Um, no, Final Fantasy is turn based. Uh, if you play Final Fantasy 7, you played a turn-based uh, game, but turn-based tactical strategy, those all those mean a, an individual thing. Those are those are things. But turn-based, yeah. Um, you think uh, that's new? Yo, I did not see the trailer, but I saw a blurb that there are. You know what I would like to see? I would like to see them do the one where the turtles turn to black people, because I saw I saw that there is there is a comic book it's not a, it's not a mainline turtle comic so that's why it's i i try if you try to search the you know black teenage mutant Ninja turtles it's gonna be hard to locate but it was it was a part of a comic book i think it was either invincible crawl it was an invincible crossover or it was a um s a static shock crossover but it was a crossover that the ninja turtle showed up in officially but and I believe it's some part of weird canon that when the turtles turned, it may not have been canon. Don't take my word for that. But they did show up in like an official crossover for an official title where they were black people. Like when they, they took it like something that would make them reverse and they reversed in that, in that universe, they reversed as some black teenagers. How we got there, I forget, but that's what happened. So I need to level this guy. But uh, yeah, this game was kind of a sleeper hit to me. I'm glad I got a chance to jump on jump on it. I'm attempting to beat it. So this year, turn-based tactical strategy games. We've got Baldur's Gate 3 coming out. Man, I see that. Uh, I see One Piece has a turn-based game. I look at it, and we we had we've had this conversation, nephew. We've had this conversation about them goddamn them, them anime games. So let me. I think I'm gonna give him this reduced movement uh, brawler this dude here I kind of don't care about him I don't care about uh, truthfully I care about novellas beyond bestia they haven't earned my respect so I got this guy I'm just gonna let him get all of his points the the i don't know the villas classes I, they're not unique enough for me right now to really give a damn about this class all right anyway all, everybody's leveled up let's get them on the move so conquer now it's all about conquering looks like i'm free to start taking over the map now i've been ready for some of that action for a while Looks like we can start taking regions, bro. Hold up. Let me get back over here. Can I start taking this one? Not yet. I want to take this one because it's so close. Oh, I can. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, let's attack this outpost so we can start moving west. Oh, yes, I can. Let me see. Make sure I got everything I need. Quest. We got some side quests. Oh, okay. I just need, my main quest is just to conquer right now. It's showing that somebody still got something. Oh, that's in the inventory. Right, we ain't tripping on that, maybe. We ain't tripping on inventory right now. All right. So let's send the uh, our man. We're about to crush these folks. Why does it have me leaving now? Oh, we're about to take this as a as a squad. Is that what happened? Now? Oh. oh man, I thought I thought they was gonna let me fight it out. Like we was on some damn the ogre battle. Say so you see the the making of Budokai Tenkachi Four. Oh what? 
Was that what was the last console that was on? Ah, I, I thought the Buddha did that not skip a couple of consoles, right? Yeah, what? I didn't realize there was a three. To be honest, I know I, I know I remember Budokai. I remember the line, the line Budokai. But see, with all of the iterations that they had since Budokai, I, what made Budokai unique enough to continue? Uh, like, did they have an original enough plot line? Yeah, what the, <laughs> Black Anytime, what the hell is that? It looks like DBZ, you don't get it. Um, I remember Budokai, I didn't play Budokai like that. See, nephew, I wish I wish you um, was on Discord. I'll bring you on so you can explain, explain that. Cause I remember Budokai. I appreciate Akira Toriyama. I'm, I, I, I'm a fan of Dragon Ball Z in that I respect what, it's, what it does to a degree, even though, you know, I respect some of what it does as far as like having that generational fam family plot line and stuff. Um, and, and the fact, you know, like crazy martial arts combat kung, um, anime, you know, I, you know, it's a long storied anime in that way. And uh, I remember seeing Budokai and I had an interesting, cool name. And I just, I can't remember. Y'all snug it up. Hey, there you go. We get a shake, shake that, that, uh, uh, that, uh, depression off. Budokai Tenkachi is basically. Well, it's basically, uh, well, I just saw that. Where you go? Basically the reason for the arena fighter like a naruto storm game see yeah the arena like 360 run around joints right there's budokai which kind of 2d and budokai tenkashi which took it to oh god it's like what a whole nother level bro hold up hold up hold up what you got? What? what's the whole new level so like because hold up because you you got xenoverse you got dragon ball z was it xeno saga dragon ball xeno um so like what is what is Budokai doing like then you got like dragon well the one's a fighting game right and then you got storm which is like yeah the arena arena joint which is uh, it's the rate of epilepsy it gives oof <laughs> damn Budokai was a traditional 1v1 FGC style fighting game Budokai okay yeah oh like uh so um Dragon Ball Z uh like the new one dragon dragon fighter like dragon fighter z right it's like that hold on let me pick my my dude real quick make sure on point. yeah we, we're going in here man we're gonna we're gonna send buddy roll here oh no he ain't really leveling he's already maxed we gotta let's max our guys out since they're in the field so much we'll send buddy we're gonna take we're gonna lose some manpower but he'll gain another what should we go with do here and get more of our artillery so we can destroy that we're gonna go with numerius bilicus let's go with numerius bilicus we're gonna take a little bit of damage it's all right it ain't gonna be too much which formation shall we use xenoverse there you go xenoverse yeah that man that's that's real that's real messed up <laughs> that's real messed up man yo Yeah, yeah, that's that's real messed up. It, it's, it's painful. That was a painful joke. You cannot escape from death. And now you've been marked. You've been marked by an angry geese Howard. All right, so um, I said I was gonna pick these and get on out of here. Let's go here so we can get the bonus. And we're going to proceed. Skip. Skip, skip, skip. Reach the enemy lines. Skip, 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 sk
Go, Skew. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Either one of these is gonna be the same, so. I'm, I'm I'm that much of a ridiculous text gamer that I would watch all this, you know, and that much of a uh, appreciator of the presentation that that whole like last little bit. I will let that play out and be enjoying that. But for the purpose of what we got going on here, I'm, I'm going to get past it so we can get to what you guys came here for. Turn based tactical strategy, which that I guess to a degree this is. See, they got like a little bit of card battle in here, right? So uh, this is interesting, and I guess it'll get deeper when I when I uh, learn more strategy, which is a thing. That you can do. Oh, I like the idea of getting my player defense bonus. Let's do that. Oh shit! He died, bro. He came back dead. Gaius Vol Volcatus Tullus died in that fight. And here I thought it was trivial. You want to see the battle? Oh, my bad. You shoot some links? Oh, that was so. Yeah, shoot throw them links. Oh, hold up. Let me make sure. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. There'll be many battles to come, so well, not at this point. I have to. There will be more ne on the next one. Here we go. Yeah, if you throw, if you want to, if you throw a link in there, throw that, throw that mug in there. Send the links. Uh, hold on, let me get back in here though. Um, so uh, imagine it, you can fight exactly like the DZB character in Budokai Tenkaichi. They have key blasts and hand to hand mash battles, tons of DBZ care, tons of characters. Um, how quick you are determined is if you come out on top of the battles. Oh my God. I, <laughs> response time is important. I'll shoot you. Okay. And so there, there's a degree of speed and skill. It's not just a button masher. So it's, that's, that's not just a bus, a button masher. Is what I understand. That's what I'm understanding. That's um. That's 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 my my gist. Let's see what let's see what you got here. When the stakes are high at work, your tone matters. Grammarly's advanced tone suggestions can help. So, so this is the the game. So this is the, this is the trailer. Hold up. So we just push buttons. I think I might have paid play this for like a hot second, like one, one, one second. So is this it? What thing it? Oh, oh, that look like a damn TV show. Man, you just saying that cause Goku. Nah, that shit does not look like the same damn shit. Oh, that ain't show me nothing. See, now I'm mad. Now, now that has made me angry. That's that's like I get into this right here, and then there's like a little bit, and it's like a little like a oh, what, the they, main, let's do the what main, the old let's people do the call main. a swallow. Yeah, now. Let's do it now. Yeah, yeah, quickly. Like a damn swallow in there. The time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing, bro? Oh, okay, okay. So I am. Uh, I'm upset. It's called a teaser. See, is that what you, is that the link? You sent me a teaser trailer. I wasn't reading. 
man i'm up here trying to be lucullus uh uh lucius <laughs> lucullus lucius the third bro all right he reading he just he just got a he just got a no, that teaser his teaser mess you know hey anybody out here uh a dead dead uh, island fan by chance or when i say dead a, a dead island player anybody play dead island and was like man this is cool i'm having a good time this dude died though he died actually and uh i hope we got his gear back that would be nice because he might have had some good gear on him and uh he's dead now let me see he was he was he was in ninth the ninth rank we're gonna have to hire somebody I'm absorbing the fact that that man died in, in, the, in the war. I'm saddened. Is it? I can't hire anybody till I get back. Shit. I'm on the move. Where am I? I need to go back to base so I can get some new people, some new blood. I must, they must want me to set my camp up somewhere. Oh, that's right. I think I moved my camp. I did move my camp somewhere else. Well, shit, while I'm doing that, let me, let me get them busy on something. Oh, this area is not, why, why do I keep saying it's not pacified? Oh, I guess I need to take over everything with my, my uh, armies. Man, I do die, bro. I'm still feeling that. <laughs> I don't think I'm tripping. Um, I, uh, let's see, you say you want to, you want to play it? You want to play dead, uh, dead Island? Did you play dead Island one? The first game wasn't too memorable for me. Oh man. Uh, okay. For, for you. That's what's up. That's what's up. Um, you just did, you know, what the first one, I guess I caught it at the right time because I have very fond memories of drop kicking zombies off of higher elevations and watching them fall over and land head first and their head explode. Like I have, I have fond memories of that. Um, but uh, you felt down, but see, dying light was too extra. And here's so far what I've seen is that there is not a parkour element of Dead Island. And I really, when I was saying, when I watched the gameplay trailer, I was saying to myself, please don't add any goddamn parkour in this game <laughs> please don't add any like dying light was cool every you know it, it was fun it's a great game i i respect it where it's at i do recognize that there was something with dead island that i i want to i want to get out my system and dying light 2 did not do that but dying light 2 did a very good dying light 2 or, I'm sorry, Dying Light. Dying Light did a very good die. The Dying Light series did a very good Dying Light. But I, I realized I was still hankering for whatever it was that Dead Rising offered. I'm sorry, Dead Island offered. I did not. I did not get Dead Island. I have not gotten Dead Island in Dead Rising. Uh, Dead uh, Dying Light. Um, what's another one? really does this kind of in that in that genre uh the first the in the the first person zombie thing oh hey. zombie adventure rpg thing i don't know you're a big you're not a big fan of parkour either i'm on the fence with them mirror's age and dead island had a baby <laughs> right that's just pretty much you're pretty spot on on that one i came back to the base to um i came back to the base. oh i need to hire i got i need to get a new hire because our one of our guys has died. <laughs> uh, let's see what we got going on here. So um, I, I want to say this: Dying Light Two was in production forever, right? I forgot when it was uh, when it was announced, but I feel like it was like shit, the middle of like 2015 or something when they announced Dying Light Two. I feel like it shit was probably even earlier than that. It's been. It's a, it was, it's like trying to trying to catch up to uh, 
star citizen as far as the longest release you with well, this dying light had so far has had the longest release with the least amount of information it's on record um but i see why they were i see why they were holding to keeping things close to their chest that gore engine I, f I forget what they call it i don't know what they call it exactly but it looks to be a engine an engine that was made from the ground up for dying light series i'm sorry dead island series looks like it was um made from the ground up for the dead island series and dead De dead island 2. Um, i might have made a mistake there what i was but what i was saying is yeah that i see why dead island 2 was under wraps so heavy this new engine that they got in there is the it looks like is it is definitely made for what i'm looking for i want a good gore uh, a good game a game that has a good gore gore good gore graphics i didn't realize i was looking for a game with a good gore engine and it looks like this might be a game that delivers a good gore engine because it might be the only gore engine for folks that are specifically trying to make an engine that push the limits on video graphic goreness, <laughs> goriness. <laughs> well, so yeah, we'll see how that works out. I need to hire somebody. Let's see. Yeah, we lost a. I think we lost a princeps, right? So we need a new princep. This a rank five. This is a rank six. This guy's a rank six triarius. Looks like he's been on the team before, but we I think we need to that guy that died as a princep, right? Let me look at the the, the party. Prince up here. You know what? Yeah, I think I'm going to recruit this dude. This rank six. No, this one. This rank six Triarius. I'm gonna recruit him. He's been with us before. Yeah. Although. I wouldn't mind. Uh, I wouldn't mind a double defense princip over that Triarius. Because we got too many Triarises anyway. I'm gonna hire this hire this double uh, double defense prince up for 200 bucks. Let's get him outfitted and leveled, and put him in the uh, travel party. Might need to send him in the dam. Let's see. Here, is this him? He's a rank six? No, that ain't him. Maybe it is him. No. No, that. It. Oh, that's weird. Where? Do I have to wait for him to show up or something? Oh, he automatically went to the, the spot. All right, hold up. I did not know they do that. I was thinking about dying light, man. That's part of the problem with dying light for me was that you too busy trying to damn flashily escape. <laughs> Your ass trying to act like buggy. You trying to bug out flashily. I just, I just want to be whooping some ass and you know, 
taking some arms off and stuff in the 3D environment and you know controlled environment. I ain't trying to do that for real life, you know. Warrior like that, like that, unless you had unless it's time to do that shit, right? All right, so this guy, um, where's his new dude? There he is. Let's give him some good gear. That is a dagger, but it's also oh, it's a unique sword. Oh, so you know what? If I break the sword down, I can apply that to somebody else's weapon and better. I'm going to break that down when I get a chance. I don't want to give him that great of a sword. All these are daggers left over. Oh, here we go. Good sword. I'll give him his good sword. Uh, the shield he has allegedly is a good shield. Looks like the armor he's wearing. The armor he's wearing won't uh, have any specific increases. You know, matter of fact, let me just break this shit down. This dude right here is a new guy, and he and he's the stuff he's got is better than the trash I'm carrying around. Oh, this is better. Why would I? Why would I use this? I'll keep him with that. I, he's going to be going on campaign anyway, so I don't, I don't think that stuff matters if he's out doing that, but, uh, all right, he's good to go. Let's put him back with the team. Party. Where is he? Here he goes. So we got two princeps and Sagittarius and two princeps and a Sagittarius. You know what? I, I don't think I would have done that, but anyway, they'll go together. Let's replenish. That's expensive. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be that expensive. All right, that's the only reason I was coming back to base. Let's get out of here. Begin with the conquest. Continue the conquest. I got that, that flat iron boy, the hot comb, them, and took care of business, laid it all down. All right, so let's, okay, so let me attack that, but that's weird. Hmm. All right, let's, there's gotta be something I can, take over somebody stalking me oh oh no we're gonna fight today only the chosen ones understand it which Kitorians will I take um I'm gonna let I'm gonna let B team run this, but I, I always let them uh, run with with old dude here because he looks after him. I was interested him and her, and we'll run some of the B team here. Oh, this dude is disgruntled. Damn it! I need to take him back to base. And I do like to have two precepts where we can, so we're gonna take that. Rank six precept. We got any other higher precepts? Prince P's. Yeah, we do. This guy right here. He's indifferent though. Put his ass in combat. He's the eye. He's gonna tap his ass and get glad. Where's old boy at? Damn, Lucius Fabius. That's the dude, boy. I think that's him. That's the dude, boy. Oh, goddamn Lucius. Put Lucius in there. I'm kind of violating not having no Sagittarius. It's rank rank eight Sagittarius. Yeah, I'm really. Oh, oh, I see what I did wrong. Let me take him out and put another Sagittarius in here. Dude, he is unwavering. He ready to damn go. All right, I'm about to do a little turn-based tactical. Thing. Like I thought this was turn-based tactical strategy night. It is. It is 
that's baked in the cake. You just waste your damn turn, all right? messing with stuff. I might have messed something up. Oh, I see what I did. I think. Guy here, this is a little small skirmish. Look at here, we're getting ransacked from multiple sides. Man, I'm always gonna try to cap that high ground. I'm going for that. So, how can we get up there? Two snipers. All right, this no, this is good. What I got going on right here? Let's swap them two. All right, we're gonna go with that. First things first, let's get old man Winter, old man Cineros. We're gonna pop off with the logistics skill, granting our team extra movement distance. Secondly, we're gonna start off with uh, Lucius Fabius to get into an attack situation. got some good weapons for the for some some hatred he's got some weapons filled with hatred over here he does stuck to enemies we were like stuck let's hit him with stuck <laughs> stick him right in the, the shin bone you gonna listen to some music to get your mind off what you're thinking about. There you go. The music's good. Thank you for stopping through. Or if you gonna turn on, which if you're gonna leave me up and then turn on the music, that's what's up. Thank you for kind of coming by uh, while you're uh, cradled in your loved one's arms there. And they say, Freedom, Freedom Black Sun salute. Thank you for them bitties. Freedom Black Sun. What's the damn dizzle on the beast of the real world? Back to the channel. It's been a while, man. What do you mean? How, how your family doing? How your, how your friends and nims? Hopefully it's good times, nonetheless, on this late hour of the day, the night. 
Um, so that person's been stuck in the feet. trouble. Ah, here we go. This is what I was looking for. Crippling shot. Even crippling shot ain't probably going to save us. You know, crippling shot is not immobile. Immobilized shot, you know. Alright, so this person right here is not the one I want to use for what I'm thinking about. This is the person I want to use for what I'm thinking about. And, uh, it looks like they can do some, some good slash damage. Uh, do we have point blank range? Point blank range. Anybody, anybody, anybody out there with a point blank range? I believe we do have a point blank range. Point blank. Let's get some point blank critical power. How am I? I'm well. I'm well. Uh, my health is good. Um, thank goodness. You know. Um, just taking care of the family and everything. Uh, Life is life is decent. You know, we're able to get a stream up. Anytime you see me up here streaming, life is life is doing pretty good. Believe that. Uh, let's see, and, and, and your bits are appreciated. <laughs> Not charity work. All right. So that person got murked, but that doesn't take us out of danger. This person can move. I think I'm gonna have them tank it a little bit. But, 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 oh man, I got an archer with armor. That's pretty cool. Alright, so. Blast cripple. Cripple times two. Let's see if, if Cripple's worth a damn to where it's going to affect them and keep them from reaching my archer. This is a test. His armor soaked up some of that, but not enough. That critical was brutal. <laughs> I'm tempted to burn this fool. I ain't gonna lie. Man, I'm gonna burn him. We'll, we'll repair that. Feeling that is hot like fire. Yo. He's burning. Alright. So we're good there. We're good there. Don't really have anything extra going here. Now let's get our tankers. Ready, ready and in position. Oh, they moved all the way to the end. All right. She's got just enough to make it all the way up the hill. So that we can get her online the better. So she can defend this side. All right, I believe that's everybody with movement. Ah, I can't continue anymore. Oh, he's freaking out. Oh, Cinero's got beat in the face. We're gonna have to come rescue Cineros. Let us unite against them. Oh, somebody, somebody, join them. Oh shit. Charge the enemy. Cut them down. Oh, we what? Reduced the numbers to the point where they have to flee. Eleven remaining. Ooh, I remember that. It took my good people to beat that mission. Well, hell's bells. Let me see. How can I get him to escape? Oh, hit him with that bludgeon damage and get the hell out of there. Prevents the target from making an attack of opportunity until their next turn. Oh yeah, that's that's what we're, we're gonna get him out of there with that. Let's get her out of here. And up 
here. And we'll move her once we get these, these shots off. This person is going to die on the next turn, I believe. Yeah, tw 12, minus 12.5% 12 health maximum per stack. It's burning, I know that burning. No, you know, I'm not sure if he's gonna get ticks of fire because I don't see it. Applies or worsens the burn status. Has, oh, no, nah, you know what? We just go. I'm, I'm, I'll burn. I'll go ahead and take him out. Uh, one of my archers. This one does piercing damage. We're going to use that. Deflect. Oh, it is deflected by shields. Never mind. Uh, all their attacks are deflected by shields. So that's problematic. We're gonna need to get that new shield down if we're gonna do anything more. So yeah, I'll just go ahead and hit him with my free attack, knock him out of the game. Let's get a Triarius in here and do some shredding. Send him up here and use a pillow. Hold up, I think a deflect don't even count towards shield damage at all so yeah although I could maybe get in there and then do this bludgeoning damage thing oh what if I throw this rock uh, oh yeah five shield damage oh yeah let's go oh no that was damn deflected awful Dang gum, I think I kind of messed myself up a little bit right there. Oh, girl, I will do something. She is. Damn it. And, well, that got rid of her, his attack of opportunity. also got rid of her shield uh, defense so I, I kind of didn't win on that however I can win on this I did all that to do this let's do some armor shred and some stuck that is very useful right now all right cool that's good now let's do a little upper cup with the upper cup. I'm gonna move them right there. We're gonna hit them with the upper cup. Let's haul it. Removes poison from allies. Let's do, let's do that. Okay. You are mostly fine. Get back into the fight. All right, cool. That worked. Uh, I definitely want this person right here. All right, get them ready. I'm just gonna hold them, hold them at this position. So anybody coming up is gonna have to deal with that shield maiden. So on the front line, we're waiting on Buddy Road, he's missing health. Alright, that's a pretty decent spread, everybody move. 
I got hope we got some unspent actions around here somewhere. Oh yeah, that's right. I, I can't do anything with here. So. If I am to die, I'll kill you as well. Oh, this fool getting back monster. up. They're going to kill us all. Oh, look at you resisting the poison just to come at me. Oof, going right up to Cisneros. Oof. Oh, it stripped her armor. Oh, they are really getting into it right now. This is my B team I sent out. I have faith they, they can do this. Have to be careful though, because we do have uh, folks throwing poison pots. That's problematic. She took a big hit right there. He has no more shield. First thing though, we need to take this person on about the game. It's plus two accuracy from high ground. So what does this do? Shoot two individually selected targets for half damage. Still alive. I hate to do that. Oh, I have pillum option. Let's do this. I got a plan here. And the armor sure won't translate. It won't take off shields, so that ain't, that's not good. Ooh, I got a plan. If he runs through there, that's gonna take off some of his shield. I don't know that much, right, but it might be better to. Back online. Now I can go for some good gusto. You know what? If I if I hold a turn, I can have my people hit harder. That would be a worthwhile situation. I think I'm gonna do that. No, I, no, I still don't have a good spot to do that. This is unnecessary. It looks like he, they gotta be up close to do that too. I don't need that much armor shred for this person. Yeah, let's go with this. Oh no, I didn't mean to get up on the front line. Damn it. That was the whole point of me looking at the other skill. Shit. I messed that up myself. Ugh. 
I think I just might have him soak some damage on this. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna let him do. I'm gonna let him soak that damage. Poison for now. This dude is almost broken. His morale has to be. Oh, his morale is almost already at minus 10. Dude, ooh, am I seeing the morale now? Oh, I see the morale now. I might be able to punk him out. Let me see something. I thought she had a morale. Here we go. Reduce the target's morale by 20. Oh, this dude don't die. Ain't no reason. No need to damn reduce his damn morale. Shit. I'm gonna stab him in the damn head. Damn simple. All right. Oh, I got unspent action somewhere. Do interrupt shot somewhere. Oh, you know what? If I can hit Buddy. Oh, I can't hit him. Is it? Oh yeah, let's do this. each other. She's attacking with damn poison arrows. That's not good. She has become em enemy number one. Then you gonna do some, some combat with her. Yeah, straight up. Chance of success plus nine on the accuracy. Range attacks and full damage regardless of distance. Well, I don't think I'm getting that, but I'm getting seven to nine. Shit, seven to eight. Uh, to them. They are not bleeding right now. Let's 
person right here needs to go. Fifteen bludgeoning damage. That's also a close up move. Hold up. 10 to 13 with the armor shred. That person has no armor. 5% crit for every hex you move. Let's go. That'd be one, one so it'd be 5%. That'd be good in that of keeping in place. Let's go. Oh, we got an action restore, really? Is that what y'all gonna do for me right now? With the armor shred and everything? Ooh, one hit. Oh, yeah. Crit chance for everything. Oh, man, let's go. have a dashing skill. I thought she did. Eh. That's fine. This person will die anyway with their one point. I keep her right there. I keep her right there. Yeah, I sure can. I can hit him as, buddy. Alright, she's good. What else we got? Like everybody's moving. I got their turns. Oh, wait a minute. Can I do this? So I'm just going to end that person's turn with the way that they are. Bleeding bloody. people remaining. Oh, wait. he didn't catch the poison, so that's good. More than 
two hexes away, huh? backwards movement. Oh, that was a terrible idea. <laughs> Whoops. Well, I got a free thing, so let me see. to get another turn so oh these guys are coming up this damn hill I need to put something on them Finally get him out of the damn poison. It's like it will. It's not really, it's not safe to go, go this way further. <laughs> we only got three more enemies remaining. I should have retreated back to where my other guys are. I wonder how this will work if I make them do this. this I guess it could make them come forward, which I'm not interested in that. to remove his poison. Support me and we shall be triumphant. Please follow my finger. Yes, you'll be alright. Alright, old man. Oh, we can restore action points. to let him buff everybody with the war horn. That was some, some swanky playing right there. Alright, 
That was some good play. This person still right here fighting. All right. Oh, this dude's got some armor, some shred. Oh, I guess he's been had him some armor. Tempted to knock him down again. I think I might just hit him with the shield though. Oh no, removes strong from self? No, I don't want to do that. I hit him with his bleed damage again. Oh, hold on. This one does more damage than bleeding. Yeah, let's go. Alright, I think that's. Oh, no, we got somebody over here with a full turn waiting to go. Oh, they're gonna love this. Still. Whoops. We will fight to the last man if needed. I control this area. Alright, we're still in good standing. At the end of this, it seems. We're taking his over here. Damn. Oh, you can't get rid of poison without getting rid of the. I don't get rid of. You can't heal without getting rid of the poison first. Refuse some help. It's all right. You're going to live. Hey, Black Elder. You hear about Michael B. Jordan? Small controversy with that crab at the bottom of the bucket. Talking about the thing where he was talking about, um, where he was saying he was corny. That thing. I. Uh, Oh, yeah, I heard about that. I heard about that. It's like, yeah. It's one of those things. I also heard that Creed, um, between foreign and domestic sales, made $100 million in its opening week. So, and, and also, from what I understand, that's a largely black-produced film. So... Yay to that! We're gonna, I'm gonna celebrate that. As far as that goes, when now, uh, when considering that topic. somebody to drag down yep yes indeed 
They're always there. I guess one thing you just gotta know when you're doing big, making big moves, it's always gonna be that. But um, I saw what he, what he really, he really felt that where he was at. He really felt where he was at, and uh, and it's I, I have no problem with him saying, you know, just so you know, I see you. Just so you know, I see you. And ain't no wrong with that. Alright, so we just got one more person to get rid of. I don't I don't see any easy prospects, so I'm just gonna hold it down right here. Uh, maybe I can get a, a free pill and kill on my What about a dagger? Dagger kill. Yeah, I can get a quick dagger kill. Hold up, I wonder if they count if I like... Oh, where they give up and flee. I wonder if I, if I like stab him to death, will that count? Or do I? I don't know. Let me see if I stab him. does not count okay so it's, it's incapacitated for each incapacitated person now I just leave her where she's at let's see anybody else oh this person right here oh this gonna get him right here hold up I got this thing boy 15 blessing damage it's gonna knock his block off he coming back from this one huh? Too short to die for a lost cause. Everybody did good. We used a lot of items. Items are to be used. Items actually make a difference in this game, so that's cool. Wolong got 47. Man, Wolong is, is straight though. Wolong is straight. I'm happy that I'm playing it. I'm happy that I that I picked it up. It's it's the perfect thing while we wait for a Neo 3. And I want, and it's been said, but Team um, team Ninja definitely know how to make one of those type games. I won't say that Neo 2 is the uh, master stroke for their development of those type games. And uh, Wo Long is definitely not the master stroke, but it is, it is, Wo Long is. A confirmation that these guys know how to make this type of game can they can pull it off they, at this point I'm I believe they might be able to crank that kind of game out in their sleep <laughs> bro hold up bro no you can't I can't be because because I know for a fact if you go searching the titles that I play you probably gonna have just me playing it so I can't even I can't even be hating on, on titles like that. You know what I'm saying? I think I, I get where you're coming from, though, for because these titles that you're talking about right here, those titles, like especially Callisto Protocol, is supposed to be like a triple A, a triple A game, right? Callisto Protocol was supposed to be like a triple K ridiculous, you know, $120 DLC release title. I get where you're coming from. I get you. I, get, I, I understand you now. I understand what you're I understand where you're coming from. That game was supposed to be a triple A title, bro. Like, all right. Triple T is triple D for dumb, da dumb, dumb. <laughs> oh, yikes. Oh, you know what? I think that actually i'm getting past my time i may do some some early work tomorrow so i'm gonna have to leave you guys for another session unfortunately we didn't get to uh take over any territory nor did i really find out where i was gonna be able to do that so sadness there but um i do have a lot of cool new prospects though so yay yay to that See, I could dispatch Legion and take some more of that, so that's cool. So, yeah, yeah. All right, but I'm gonna save here so I don't get, I don't, I'm not up too late tonight.
You know what I'm saying? seeing the override option. There it is. Okay. Super Mario 64 got 6,000 viewers and Callisto Protocol. Man, Callisto Protocol got, got 15, bro. That's a strong 15, though. So, you know what I'm saying? Then you don't, you don't need a whole lot of people when you got quality people. You don't need a whole lot of people when you got quality people. Right. You just get a whole bunch of collateral damage. But yeah, it's cool. I'm um, glad everybody stopped through. Um, thank you for Get ready for the next one. I'll be back on more, some more expeditions tomorrow. Don't forget, we get your hands on that keyboard, joystick, gamepad, mouse, or light gun. Be sure to be good. And we'll catch you on another one. Not to soon be failed like 